Hello everyone, welcome to this video and in this video I'm just going to show you that how you can actually change uh, the package name of your Android application inside Android Studio and this is very important for every single developer who just uh, buy their source code from others or maybe you have uh, uh, the whole application you just made and you want to publish this thing on Google Play Store so then you just need uh, the unique package name that uh, don't even uh, exist in Play Store or other uh, application don't have that package name okay so how you can actually do that thing I and mean, when uh, if you have already created an application and you want to change the package name then how you can do that thing so in this video I'm just going to show you that okay so how you can actually see that this example.com dot app where where these things uh, actually is there I mean where you can find that thing okay so you can see that this uh, little gear icon which is actually settings icon so you have to click on this thing and then you have to uncheck this one which is compact middle packages okay so we have to uncheck the compact middle packages and if we just do that you can see that uh, now there is example if I just expand this thing I can find that com okay example example examples under you can find com, com and here is the com and then under the com you have app okay so under com we have app first we have example here is the example then we have com here is the com and then we have app here is the app okay so inside the app you can find different app activities if you just uh, inside the java folder so you have main activity splash screen activity and splash activity which is actually a kotlin i just made a previous video about the splash screen so you can uh, watch that thing in the description box below so that this is a project okay uh, so if I just go to the main activity you can see that the package name is example.com.app so we are going to uh, change the example with our name and com with our domain name okay so how we can do that thing uh, we have to go to the build.gradle files uh, which is actually in here in gradle script and you can find the <laughs> build.gradle file and then you have to go to the application ID okay so where we can find that thing here is the application ID okay application ID and you have to change the application ID with your own domain name or your name or uh, whatever you just use uh, but remember here we have example com and app okay if you don't have uh, the three uh, example com or app you may have other uh, package name maybe you have uh, something dot something then dot com dot app okay maybe you have uh, like uh, see that you have uh, that thing uh, like yt dot example dot com dot app so in this case you have to uh, make sure that you just replace this yt with something else or you can keep that thing or then you have to replace this thing and then you have to replace this thing but if you don't have this white you just only have the example dot com dot app then you cannot add extra something and this is going to be a hassle for you so my recommendation is keep that simple just uh, replace those existing things like example dot com I'm just going to replace all those things in here so what I'm just going to replace is example I'm going to uh, replace this thing with com and sorry my caps locks are open so I'm replacing this thing with com and with this com I'm just going to replace this thing with uh, my domain name so this is actually petagip so all those things are replaced and after that I have to uh, sync the, this thing okay so if I just sync this thing this thing is sync okay so I just change uh, the com and petagip and uh, you can also ch change this name which is actually app but you sh uh, most of the people just refer that this should be the app name but I my app name was first uh, app and I just changed this thing with the splash screen so it's not a big problem so you have to change this thing with your Android app name you may already have that thing but no problem and then we're we just going to change uh, this com and better give uh, like here okay so in this place you have the com okay so this example should be replaced with com so how we can actually replace this thing just right click on the example and just go and go to the refactor and 
then rename it okay so if i just rename it i have to change this thing to com and then refactor it and you will find this little uh box which is actually where your uh, things are going to change okay so if i just uh, see that eight refactors and eight files okay so i want to change this thing okay so do refactor and all those files change so you can see that com everything is changed uh, here is the com all those example files are replaced with com now we are just going to uh, change this com with the petagip okay so same way just press on this thing refactor rename rename packages and i'm going to change this name to petagip and then just refactor it and you can see that 11 reference in eight files okay eight files and 11 reference is going to be changed so do refactor no problem so better give and everything is changed now you can see that the com the better give and then app everything just changed so that's how we can actually change the uh, change the package name after doing all those things you just going to go to the build and then just clean project and if you just clean this project all those cache memories are going to clean and you are just going to get a fully clean a project and you can actually change this thing so let's go let's run this application in our uh, devices so that we can actually check this thing is changed or not now you can see my phone screen on this computer so if i just go to the open uh, and open this application which is actually splash screen so this is the splash screen application i just made so uh this is the application okay so how i can actually find that the uh, uh, application is just uh, changed i mean the package name of this application changed so here is the application which is actually called uh, package names and you can find this thing on Google Play Store. So the checkbox, you can see that this application has its own package name, which is com.pedagip.com. Okay, so let's just go to there. You can see that com.pedagip.app, com.pedagip.app. So the application is just changed. So which application was this? You can go to the Play Store and you can download this application, which is called Android package names. And here is the application you can you have to download okay there is like other application you can use uh, so this was the application and in this way you can actually change uh, the package name of your android application and always try to use uh, uh, the unique package name from the beginning when you're just going to start building your application so you can you should uh, you don't have to uh, take much hassle so stay cool stay creative goodbye